But today is National Strawberries and Cream Day. Perfect time for a refreshing bite of strawberries and whipped cream. Strawberries and whipped cream is pretty low calorie. It's pretty healthy. Not everyone's looking for a low cal snack, right? I mean, I want a, I want a higher cal snack. Uh, <laughs> joining us, maybe something you want to try a little bit sweeter today. Joining us now, uh, uh, the Denver Pie Queen, Chocolatina, is here. Thanks so much for coming in. Hello, yeah, my we pleasure. Appreciate it. My pleasure. Hi. Hello, right. nice Hello. to see you again. Nice to see you too. <laughs> so, what pie are we going to make today? So, I'm doing a version of banana cream pie and making a um, strawberry cream pie. Okay. So, it's the same ingredients as a banana cream pie. Um, this is pastry cream. Uh, you could do, you could use a vanilla pudding. It's basically the same, a fancy vanilla pudding. Yep. And you just layer that in with. Uh, with the strawberries. And, it, um, do you always oh. do the piping bag like that? I do. Now, I, I let Chris do it last time, but... <laughs> do you, did I yeah. do a bad job? I can no, do No, you were good. <laughs> and then you just layer them in there like that. <laughs> and we're going to have... Um, very good at that. Yeah. yeah you could the, So if you don't have a piping bag, you could take like a Ziploc bag at home and just cut the corner off of it, right? Absolutely, okay. yes, yeah. yes. You, sounds like you've done it before. I've and done then, that before, yeah. So Not very is, well. This is a <laughs> strawberry gelée. Now you can use... in the recipe I have on the line, it's... Um, like r strawberry jam or strawberry jelly, you can use okay. that. Okay. So you want to try piping? Okay. Oh, Let's do yeah. this. Let's see I know how he does. I let him do it last. You make it look so easy, but see reality, that's pretty see. good, Chris. Give yourself some yeah. credit. Thanks. I think <laughs> you probably want that's more than that, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. You just like, see, yeah. Fill it up. Okay. Okay. Uh, we'll come back to that one. Now this is a strawberry cheesecake, which is, um, of course, cream as, as well. And um, for this one, I finished it on the top with a little roasted strawberry. That's a really good way to make your strawberries taste really good mm. if they're not. You could put them in the oven with a little sugar, vanilla, balsamic vinegar. About and how long? Just, uh, it, just it takes they about look a little crispy. I know. You want the juices to reduce so okay. it's nice and flavorful. Okay. And then we're just going to top this with some fresh strawberries like that. If you want to. Sure, I can help, help me out that. with that. I can do that. See, so you've pre-cut yeah. them so we don't I have did, any incidents on television. So just kind of make a. A nice sort of flowery top to that. This is fun. I'm sure when Ryan? you do this, it looks a whole lot better than when Chris and I do this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Maybe a there little. I don't know. Just a tad. <laughs> just a tad. <laughs> so we're just going to fill this one all the way up. Okay, so going back to the, the original. <clears throat> yep. yep. And then we're going to put a little whipped cream on top because it's strawberries and cream day. Why not? Yes. So... See, that looks so much nicer See, than anything. Now, the key is to hold it at the end okay. and squeeze. Do you okay. want to try sure. I, yeah. I can. So I'm not yeah. going to be able to give it the hold it at the end and squeeze. Yeah. There we go. Look at you. Perfect. That's Should I go per to the middle? Spot on. Oh, my God. You've done this before, haven't I've you? I've done it once or twice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> there we go. And then just wow. like that. Wow, lovely. Look at you. All right. Like and then you can, like... I brought these little white chocolate flowers. You could put you could put more strawberries on top if you want. You were talking so. about these dried strawberries. Too. Yeah, so these are dried, freeze dried strawberries. They add a little crunch. You could also just sort of crunch some of those on top, it's like Perfect. that. You can get them at uh, Trader Joe's is a good place to get those, and it adds a little crispiness to your strawberries and cream. Love yes. it. So we can look right now, but we cannot mm. touch because coming up after weather, we are gonna. Taste this. Okay. Are you? Okay. Good. Taste so after this. the seven day, we get to taste these. After the seven day, only okay. after the seven day. <laughs> yeah. All right. Day. We're back here with the pie queen, Chocolatina. We're talking. We're, we're finally going to get to eat. The You're going to get to taste now. But while we eat, yes. we want to demonstrate. I just want to give you a little tip on. Um, we couldn't be trusted with you. This. Couldn't. This, no. Couldn't. Thank you. Yeah. So this is the strawberry rhubarb pie. So rhubarb is just starting to come into season, and it's a natural pairing with the strawberries. So this is an easy way to do the the top of your pie with a lattice. Mm -hmm. So I know Martha Stewart like makes you lift it up and fold it under and mm -hmm. all that stuff. So if you just sort of do it like this, just sort of alternate back and forth across the top. And of, of course, these are egg wash to make it nice and shiny and brown when you bake it. Oh, and really so you go, and crispy. And, oh. Yeah. So you just go oh, one. Oh, yeah. Look at like, that. Across, across, across. And then, you know, I don't have time for lifting it up and weaving it by hand. <laughs> I've got a lot of pies to make, so, but it just gives it that woven look yeah, looks, without looks actually, beautiful. yeah, without actually. And just tear right off the edge. Yeah, just tear the edge, Yep. flip that around. Oh my gosh, yeah. that looks great. And then you're ready does to. Does it bubble up a little bit through the? It does bubble, oh, yeah, yeah, as you see on that one right there. It oh, yeah. sort of Here's bubbles around. Finished product. Overflowing with goodness. Well, and then you just. Finished product. Pull up the edge there and then you just crimp it around and then I like to put a little uh, raw sugar on top. It makes it a little crunchy and a little sweeter. Love it. Just like that. 
How's the pie, guys? Oh, my God, it's wonderful. <laughs> as good as it looks. Oh, <laughs> right, thank thanks. you so much for coming. Yeah, my pleasure. It.